Hi there. The level of reactive oxygen species is, is determined in cells by an interplay between ROS scavenging and ROS production. This allows ROS to be maintained in a certain range, preferably the redox biology range. And that will allow um, cells to actually control uh, many, many different processes, uh, including proliferation, stress acclimations, uh, different signal transduction reactions, differenti differentiation and development, metabolic regulation, pathogen defense, and physiological cell death. Now, if ROS levels are decreasing below a certain level, then due to the requirement of ROS for cellular proliferation, um, the cells will enter a cytostatic state and will not proliferate, and therefore life cannot really go on. In contrast, if ROS will um, get to be too high into the cytotoxic or the oxidative stress range, then it can induce cell cellular injury. So in order for plants to maintain um, a healthy life cycle, they, re they need to re keep reactive oxygen species within the redox biology range and enable um, the maintenance and regulation of many, many different processes. So remember, if you're an aerobic organism, ROS are good. Uh, but too much or too little of a good thing can be bad for you. So just keep Ross at the right level and be happy.